How's it? Dr. Rudy here. Today I'm going to talk to you about skin cancer. They're those horrible little clumps of mutant cells you get in your face when you're exposed to too much sun. Did you know that if you immigrated to this country after the age of 15, that you are five times less likely to get skin cancer? You see, the sun does most of its damage to native-born Australians when they are children with delicate skin. So this is great news for all us adult immigrants. Whilst those dinky dye Aussies end up looking like pale and pasty vampires, we immigrants can get a fabulous tan. As a medical doctor, I really do encourage all immigrants to this country to get as much sun as possible. Do not slip on a shirt, do not slip on some sunscreen, and do not slap on a hat. Because it's a biological fact that people become more attracted to the opposite sex when they have a tan. Which means that sunbathing will give us immigrants an evolutionary edge. Quite simply, a person with a tan will get more sex. We all subconsciously equate glowing good health with fertility. And despite what our conscious mind tells us, we all enjoy going through the motions of trying to get each other pregnant. So to sum up, sunbathing. If you're a native-born Australian, don't do it or you'll die of cancer. If you're an immigrant, get a tan. You'll get more sex. Bye now.